Hi guys and welcome back to another video here at our channel of Handy Games. Again, it's Jan, your favorite tester and video maker here at our channel. Um, for today I prepared a tutorial video and this time we will have a look at how the sheep health, dangers and satisfaction work in Clouds and Sheep 2. So and if you're thinking, uh, wait a minute, Clouds and Sheep 2? Yes, that's right, we just released it for Android and iOS, so if you have not already downloaded it, head over to the App Store or to the Play Store, whatever your preference is, and download it and enjoy the game for free. Okay, now let's get started. Here we are at my sheep pasture, and as you might notice, something is missing. Yes, the sheep are missing, of course. Well, what happened? Um, I was a very bad shepherd, and I was not able to provide for my sheep. So the only thing that remained on my sheep pasture is this sad little graveyard over here. But what can we learn from that? Basically, there are many things that can happen to your sheep. The first one, um, yeah, he lies buddy. He got struck by lightning. I have no idea if it was intentional or an accident, but yes, that is what hit him. Second, huh? Emily. Well, I was not able to give her some uh, warm clothes or um, yeah, some uh, campfire. So she froze, also very sad. Molly, I was not able to give her enough to eat. And last, Katie, I was not able to give her something to drink or enough to drink. Yes, that's a very sad state, but if you don't uh, have the ability or whatever happens to your sheep and you can't provide for them, we give you a new sheep for free. Just put it over here. And the next one is only one happy star. So whatever happens, you can always rebuild your pasture. And of course, we can revive our poor sheep. So let's get Buddy back. Let's get Emily back, let's get Molly back, and let's get Katie back. Storage is full, yeah, whatever, I don't care. Give me more. Mm. And Katie, and here we are! Just as God made them, but naked. <laughs> Except for Katie. Well, alright. So, our cheap pasture looks quite nice now. And uh, yes, those were the causes for death. Um, so just look out, give your sh enough to eat, just put Emily over here, here, get some rain clouds, put water poodles on the ground, it's very straightforward. And sometimes you just have to look out for lightning clouds, but as of now the sky is very clear, so it's no problem. Also we have some poisonous mushrooms, let's see if I can find some on my pasture. No, seems pretty clear so far. So yes, that's basically it. It's very easy, very straightforward. Give your sheep enough to eat, give your sheep enough to drink. Don't let them hit, get hit by lightning. Don't let them eat poisonous mushrooms. And if, uh, if you see that your sheep are starving or need something to drink, just have a look over here. You can give them like this bucket of water over here. Then they can drink, you also have a injection so you can heal them, you have this hot water bottle over here to cure them if they are cold. Yes, and a lot of options. That's it so far I guess for this short tutorial video. If you liked it, as always, like and subscribe so you can enjoy some more videos on our channel. That's it, see you guys next time!